Hey, what's happening, guys? It's Tyler from Valve News Network, and today I'm going to be talking about the Steam Greenlit Source Remakes of Half-Life Opposing Force and Blue Shift, Operation Black Mesa, and Guard Duty. Here we go. <laughs> Now, in case you don't know, Operation Black Mesa and Guard Duty are two remastered source mods in the vein of Black Mesa. This time, they are remaking Half-Life Opposing Force and Half-Life Blue Shift. However, the history of these mods is incredibly shaky, and it just seems like this mod would never come out at certain points in time. But we know it is now, and this is the history of those mods. Operation Black Mesa started life after Valve announced Half-Life Opposing Force Source for PC. This news came out shortly after Half-Life Life Source was also announced, which of course was just bringing Half-Life itself to the Source engine. But after what the development team saw happens to Half-Life Source in that it really was not a remaster in any case, but really just a straight port of the original game, they decided it was not worth the wait of waiting for Half-Life Opposing Force Source and instead worked on an actual remastered remake themselves. Around the same time, in 2006, a mod called Blue Shift Source starts development by some Russian modders. They put out a crew media release on their own website and start talking about that mod. Shortly after, on June 21st, they open up their own mod DB page and call the project Barney's Tales. The opposing force projects moved forward in development, but actually stayed silent on their mod DB page until September 17th, 2006, with their very first media release. This media release, however, was very early and primitive and showed some very early in game screenshots. On November 18th, 2006, Barney's Tales started changing its name around to Blue Shift Source, again, as seen within its second media update on mod DB. On January 1st, 2007, the Operation Black Mesa team announced that there would be some script changes to the actual Half-Life Opposing Force story. They also announced at this point that the Operation Black Mesa team actually joined forces with another mod team that shared the same goals of remastering Opposing Force. Now sometime between January 1st and September 29th, Operation Black Mesa died, but the project was picked back up by a completely different team and listed as relaunched with a new head of development on September 29th, 2007. On December 17th, 2007, Operation Black Mesa has a pre-production media release, showing that this new team was starting from scratch and was not using much of the original Operation Black Mesa assets. This media release included mostly concept art and models, and the team stated that Operation Black Mesa felt more organized than ever. On January 28, 2008, Barney's Tales released its first Mod of the Year trailer, as seen here. Welcome, Mr. Gala. I presume you thought that I would not pay attention anymore. Well, you were on. It's time to wake up you bad. Hope you're ready for a long shift. Again. Obviously, the trailer was very, very primitive, and the voice acting for the G-Man was not. Final. On January 29th, 2008, Blue Shift Source switches names between Barney's Tales and Blue Shift Source once again. But they show off some more screenshots and once again give themselves a tentative release date of fourth quarter 2008 or first quarter 2009. On January 29th, 2008, the Blue Shift Source development team gives a tentative release date of fourth quarter 2008 or first quarter 2009. Now, a few media releases happened between January and October of 2008 for Operation Black Mesa. But on December 3rd, the forms that Operation Black Mesa had had owned was hacked by one of the former mods that ran the form itself. And for a while, the development team took a break from working on the mod. But on October 25th, 2008, a teaser trailer was released for Operation Black Mesa.
and on December 23rd, 2008, Operation Black Mesa shows off some more pictures and wishes everyone a good holiday. They stayed silent until April 25th, when it seems like the team were really getting stuff together and they really had a lot to show. In celebration of Opposing Forces' 10th birthday, Operation Black Mesa shows off a lot of screenshots and concept art. This is on November 1st, 2009, and on November 6th, 2009, Barney's Tales is officially stated as cancelled and the project itself was renamed to Guard Duty, with a brand new team of people working on it. This team also stated that they were going to include a full source remastered remake of the Half-Life Uplink demo. On February 1st, 2010, the first official media of the Guard Duty mod is released, and this media looks way more professional than anything that the Barney's Tales team was able to do. Now at this point, the respective mods continued to work on recreating their own respective expansion packs. They would release screenshots and music and videos along the way, and all of this development continued, until early 2012 when it was announced that the Operation Black Mesa team was merging with the Guard Duty team to create Tripmine Studios. On April 30th, 2012, the first media release from Tripmine Studios is put out, and this changes the way that the Guard Duty and Opposing Force remakes were talked about. The media releases themselves would talk about both mods at the same time, and the updates would be available on both mod DB pages. On December 8th, 2012, Tripmine Studios states its intentions to put Operation Black Mesa and and guard duty onto the Steam Greenlight program. Along the same time, they also released some excellent looking screenshots. On February 16th, 2013, Tripline addresses the question about using Black Mesa assets in their mods. They completely deny that they will be using any of these assets as they one, slow down the process of actually coding through their own assets, and two, it actually limits the amount of things that they're able to do with their game. On August 8th, 2013, Operation Black Mesa and guard duty get greenlit. At the same time, the team promises to release a beta of the Operation Black Mesa multiplayer by the first quarter of 2014. On March 29th, 2014, the Operation Black Mesa multiplayer beta was cancelled. A lot of media was shown and a lot of gameplay elements were talked about in this newest ModDB post, but this was the last ModDB post that was actually made in terms of any kind of written material. Because on December 13th, 2014, a new screenshot was added to the Operation Black Mesa ModDB page, and this was the last thing that tripped my Studios has done. In terms of the mod's development, it is known that it is still being worked on and this mod is far from dead. But how far the mod itself is actually along is unknown to the public. But anyways, that was everything we know about the Opposing Force and Blue Shift remakes that have been Steam greenlit. There is another Blue Shift remake called Insecurity, but that one has been long dead. If you like anything that you've seen in this video, please check the link in the description below to be able to see the mod DB pages of these mods. But anyways, as you know, I'm Tyler McVicker. Please like, favorite, subscribe, comment, do all that stuff. It helps me out immensely. If you want to see me do a blue shift or opposing force live stream, please check out my Twitch channel and my second channel, Valve News Extra. But anyways, as you know, thanks for watching. I'm Tyler McVicker. This is Valve News Network. Thanks a lot, guys. Adios.